Hey, what is up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to play OSRS Old School RuneScape Steam Edition in full screen mode. In my previous video I did show you how to play the normal default OSRS client alongside the RuneLite client in full screen mode. But today I'm going to show you how to play the Steam version of Old School RuneScape OSRS in full screen mode. Now, in my previous video I did mention that the applications which I was using to make OSRS go into full screen was not actually working with the Steam version of the game. But as you guys can see, I am now running the Steam version and I'm getting a nice 60 FPS here. And let me just go to options and show you that this is the Steam version because we've got the interface scaling here option enabled. With the other versions, I don't think this option is there. So what I'm going to do today, I'm going to show you guys how to play OSRS and get it in full screen mode using the Steam version of the game and it's quite simple you just have to use an extra application and it's a free application so you don't have to pay for it it's completely free and hopefully by the end of the video you should be able to play OSRS old school RuneScape Steam version in that full screen mode okay so if I was to quit after the game now as you guys can see I'm in the Steam application right now and if I click on play let me just show you. It's going to go into the game and it's going to turn into full screen. There we go. So as you guys can see, I'm now in full screen mode. If you guys were to try this on the Steam version, it would only go into windowed mode. And it's really annoying having the top title bar and the taskbar showing. And it's really annoying because if you want to stream your videos or upload it to YouTube or whatever, then you will have those annoying bars and you might have to crop it in your editing software. But using this free application, you should be able to play OSRS in full screen mode for the Steam version with no issues. Now, just to make you aware that the game client layout, if we go to fixed classic layout, which is this one, it still remains as small as you are seeing now. If you want to make this bigger, you would have to change your desktop resolution. Or alternatively, if you want to play this mode in full screen mode, then have a look at my previous video and you'd have to use room light and then switch to this mode with the stretch mode enabled. So with the Steam client, unfortunately, you can't play it like this with full screen. Unfortunately, with the Steam client, you can't play this fixed classic layout stretched. It will be like this. So if you guys have been playing the Steam client, you would know this, that even in windowed mode, you can't play it like this with everything stretched out. So we will switch this to resizable classic layout. And as you can see, it's now resizable classic layout in full screen mode and if I change it to the resizable modern layout as well again it's in full screen mode as you guys can see there okay so I'm going to show you guys what application I have been using to get OSRS old school RuneScape Steam Edition in full screen mode okay so the first thing you'll need to do is download the external application so if we go to uh, your internet browser and just type in borderless gaming and if we just scroll down and the link I got it from was this one, which is the textbot.com link. And this is the application. So it's called Borderless Gaming. And the version I'm using right now is version 9.5.6. So if we just click on the download now key, close this down, wait for that to start downloading. And as you can see, it's almost finished downloading. And there we go, it's finished downloading. So I'm gonna open this file now and I'm gonna set it up. Let's just close this down click on next. I'm going to actually install this to my D drive. There we go. So it's going to be installed in D drive borderless gaming. Click on next, create a desktop shortcut. Yes. And then just install it. And there's a small application and then we can start using it. Right. So as you guys can see, I've already got old school runescape here in my favorites. Now chances are that this bit will be blank. So if you just get rid of that for now, now, if you want to go to your Steam client and just start playing old school RuneScape and wait for it to load up in windowed mode. Now, if I return to the borderless gaming client, as you can see, I've got old school RuneScape showing here. So all I need to do is just click on that and click this arrow and it will put it in the favorites section and make it automatic. And now if I go back into the game, as you can see, I am now in fully full screen mode and I've got the annoying taskbar or the title bar showing on the top there. And if I was to just quit out of this as well, 
and minimize that. And then if I click on play again, you will notice it will automatically go into full screen mode. There we go. Let's just wait for that to log in. And yeah, and that's how you play the OSRS old school RuneScape client for the Steam version in full screen mode. If you guys don't like the Steam client, obviously please do go ahead and use the RuneLive client. Uh, but do check out my video because I do mention how to play that in full screen mode as well. Obviously you can use the Borderless Gaming client for all of the other RuneScape clients if you wanted to and get those to play in full screen mode as well. But all the other applications which I've tried in the past, because this is a Steam client and it's got the Steam overlay, they haven't been able to maintain full screen. And this is the only application I've found after a lot of research and reading up about the, the application on forums and stuff. So hopefully you guys have found this video useful. If you have, then please do give us a like. If you have any comments or queries about this application or how to play OSRS Old School RuneScape Steam version in full screen mode, then please do leave it in the comment section below and I'll do my best to try and help you. Obviously, please do subscribe to this channel to help support to help it grow. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.